preview so that you can follow throughout the service. You note in the um, words that I printed at the beginning, morning prayer used to be a weekly staple of worship in the Episcopal Church, but things have changed over time. And this morning we're going to experience that form of worship once again. So use your bulletin and it'll help get you uh, through the service if you're not familiar with morning prayer. Um, Judge Smith has a bit more to say about our music this morning. So, Ted of the fear me? Think I'll let you win? I have returned to spread my evil to the world. I have returned to spread my evil. For I am the map and the shadow of doubt. The dark shadow of doubt. That dark cloud over all humanity. The shadow of doubt. Oh, that will spread my evil around the world. Today we celebrate Martin Luther. He was a good king. Then we celebrate Rodney King. He was a bad king. Then there was then there was Ahab. He was the worst king of all. Then there was then there was was Osama Laden. He was the worst king of all. When Jesus Christ was playing the Herky Jerky of a lot of people with Jonas and Jonas and Judas, they were celebrating the Herky Jerky with Mary Magdalene. And, and then we hear the Herky Jerky with the horizontal Pokemon with Jesus and Moses. Then we celebrate the days that the kings was the lion and David the king. Then we are there's the spalding and mouth and things celebrate instead of the joy of peace. Today we celebrate that Sunday. We celebrate great peace and having as much fun as possible. We celebrate the joys of Jesus Christ, the power of the Holy Spirit. What's his name? The Lord is good. His mercy is everlasting. And the truth endures from generation to generation. Amen, motherfucker. Hello, 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 don't anybody move, alright? I know we have a lot to cover this week, but let's get started. Now Jesus was gathered before a large crowd, a big crowd had gathered, and wanted to hear him speak. And all the, the people gathered to hear him speak and all that. So basically, Jesus said, Whoever does not honor thy mother and father is a fool. Those who honor thy mother and father is a great one. Those who wage war and terror or evil are fools. Those who stand for peace are, are great ones. And I love the world so much. I love people so much. We should bless the people. For this is why I say, this is the gospel of the Lord. So basically that's what point it has to say. That's what it says. So next time, the thing about waging war or violence or anything, next time your brother or sister wants, wants to fight with you, to say, don't do it. I love you so much, I let anything bad ever happen to you. So basically, so basically, next time we'll wage war or violence, and to say, hey, I love you so much, and I want to be peaceful. I think that's what I have to say. You know? So bless God and honor God. Amen. Now I feel, excuse me, I have someone to teach. So, shadow of doubt you have returned. Your evil ways are no more. I will defeat you. And so it says in the Bible, we will reap what we sow. So, you think of the FBA, Ted Harris? Well, I will, will show these evils. Those, those douchebags will really show their evil. I will spread my evil around the world. So, shadow of doubt, you are, you are too evil for your own good. Have your past thoughts that learned you nothing? It says in the Bible, evil never wins. And so we learned a lesson.
the evil never wins. And doubt is the enemy of faith. Go forth and sin no more. Hi kids, we know about the power of Jesus Christ and all that, all the powers we had to go through. So let's say this simple prayer now. Oh my Jesus, I may have sinned. I bet I commit myself to Jesus. I commit myself to Jesus, now forever. In Jesus' name, amen. That's it. You're now in the power of Jesus Christ. So bless his name, for the Lord is good. His mercy is everlasting, and his truth endures from generation to generation. Thank you. Yay, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you so much. It's always an honor when we come to the end of a season, especially when it's been successful as this one. I want to thank all the people out there for making Ted Harris's Bible series best year, this year project ever. This is the best summer project ever. It's always, always an honor when we come to the end of a season. And the season, especially when it's been as successful as this one. Anyway, um, this is not often that I even get accepted into this church. And I'm probably graduating like that, so with honors, and uh, so with daily psychological counseling and all that. Anyway, I also want to thank Reverend Tom Cook and Joyce for doing these things, and the City of Swarth War for putting up a thing. All the people out there who stuck to this project and did ask me questions and did not call the police. And also want to thank Willie Ames and and Mega Mindy and and Garrett McClendon, James Leach, Fatima Deboya, Papa Candy, Dave Dove, Cindy Hennessy for putting up with me. Um and I also want to thank, um, um, also want to thank Jim Henson, Frank Oz, Jerry Joel, Jerry Dolson, Kevin Johnson, and, um, Terry Fader for putting it with me, also Megan Milder for putting it with me, well, yeah, um, Mom, Dad, I love you so much, and and Lindsay for the glory of my second generation, and Grandmom, she came with us today, which is with us in spirit, and and right, she came with us today, which is with us in spirit. So thank you so much for putting up me, and thanks a lot of people for making this best best summer project ever. Thank you.